uh, due to the economic conditions in Turkey. However, Otokar uh, was uh, successfully achieved 30% uh, of uh, the market share in Turkey uh, and we are still the leader uh, in the 7 to 10 meter range. In terms of our export performance, uh, we have achieved 163% growth, which uh, satisfies our uh, needs. In terms of uh, the value, we achieved 161 million euros, and this created an 81% of our uh, revenue coming from our exports. Uh, in terms of our exports, we mainly sold uh, to Europe. This is our main market. And uh, Autocar's uh, vehicle park has reached 3,250 vehicles in our main markets, France, Italy, Belgium, and Spain. In 2019, uh, France remained uh, the first export market. Uh, this is followed by our uh, Italy, Spain, and Belgium markets. We have continued to deliver our Kent and Territo vehicles to our key account fleets in Malta, Italy, and Serbia. We are also continuing our efforts in terms of uh, giving better service and spare parts throughout, uh, our, uh, uh, throughout our networks. Last year, we won an important tender in Bucharest and we achieved uh, deliveries within 2019, earlier than planned, uh, of 400 buses. And these buses are operating successfully in uh, the streets of Bucharest today. So, uh, we are happy to introduce you several new buses. I'd like to start with our Terito. This vehicle on the left hand side or your right hand side is uh, our new version of uh, our intercity bus. We are showing 13 meter bus today. It's a school bus to start with and it will be available from 2020 which next year. So this vehicle we developed by learning from our uh, previous territory intercity vehicle and improved the maneuverability. We had an, a, a lightweight construction for this vehicle and we worked on the driving comfort to give better uh, driving uh, to our customers. Uh, this uh, vehicle will be a family of vehicles and uh, therefore we will be introducing different lengths uh, and different uh, engine solutions in diesel and CNG. We will also have a small horsepower or big horsepower depending on the applications. We will have a class two and class three uh, as well. And therefore it will be a, a family uh, vehicle range. Our next uh, new vehicle is uh, electric ECAN C, which is introduced in UITP in Stockholm this year. Since we have been uh, working on the tests uh, to finalize the vehicle, and this vehicle will be available in 2020 as well, and we will be selling this vehicle in the second half of 2020. The vehicle uh, introduced in UITP is the same as this one, uh, shows uh, 300, up to 300 kilometers of range, and we uh, equip this with electrodynamic regenerative braking systems and a state-of-the-art control panel integrated in the dashboard. We will also have an 18 meter and other lengths uh, for our uh, electromobility range. Our next vehicle uh, is in fact for our CAN series. We are introducing uh, from class one to class two, a low entry version uh, today. It's again a 12 meter bus and uh, it's, a, it's a class two today. The next vehicle we are introducing again today, it's our uh, mid-size coach on the right-hand side or your left-hand side. It's a 10 meter bus. We, are, we introduced the, the third door in the middle for our lift, of, lift option. And the first delivery starts in Spain this year. 
And the last vehicle we introduce today in our uh, area is the Kent uh, CNG. It's basically it's a new uh, uh, power line uh, we are introducing, and we will be continuing to doing this for our 18 meter bus and 10.8 uh, meter bus as well. And depending on the customers' expectations, we will be customizing our solutions uh, for our CAN series, including this CNG. This covers the presentation we have, and thank you very much for your presence today.